Okay, a uh, short topic here, but key to the understanding of uh, some of the later work in the course, okay, is coterminal angles. So let's first look at an angle, say, 60 degrees. Okay, so there's a 60 degree angle. So is there any other way we can express 60 degrees other than 60? Okay. Is there any other angle that when I say that angle means the same thing as 60? Okay. Well, let's take a look at this type of scenario. Starting from the origin, going all the way around. Okay. So a full 360 degrees, and then back up to here. So you can think of taking an imaginary arm, okay, and I said, okay, I want this marker to be at 60 degrees. Okay, so here it is at 60 degrees. And I don't, I don't care about the path that it's taken, all I care is where it's come to rest. Okay, so here it is at 60 degrees. Okay, what if this marker went a full 360 plus another 60 degrees again? Okay, well, it would have traveled 420 degrees. So 420 degrees and 60 degrees okay, end up in the same place, end being terminal, co meaning the same or together. Okay, so 60 degrees and 40 degrees end in the same place. Okay. Another way that we can think of this, okay, so there's 420 degrees is co-terminal. And we could keep doing this forever as well. Okay. I could go around once, there's 420. I could do it another time. Okay. If I did it another time, I've gone another full 360 degrees, add 360 to that, okay? 780 degrees is also coterminal. Okay. So there's two coterminal angles with 60 degrees. Let's look at it another way. Okay. What if I did this? Instead of going forward 60 degrees, okay, I go backwards, okay, and for our purposes, backwards is clockwise, okay, so I go start at the origin, go backwards, okay, well backwards 300 degrees, and there was minus 300 degrees, puts me in the same place, okay, so that's coterminal as well, okay, so we start with 60 degrees, and we also said 420 degrees is coterminal, and so was 780 degrees. We can go backwards. We can start at 60 degrees as our original angle. All minus 300 degrees is that same angle. Same principle as applies as before. Okay, I started. I went backwards 300 degrees. Puts me in the same location. I could keep going another time. So another backwards 360 puts me in the same spot. So a negative 660 degrees is coterminal, okay, and so forth. Okay, it's not an overly complex thing to be able to do, but you have to understand that 60 degrees and 420 degrees give you the same result. Okay, so if I took the sine of 60 degrees, or if I took the sine of 420 degrees, I'm going to get the same result because they end in the same place. And okay, so that's important for later on in the course, but for now, just know that 60 degrees and 420 degrees are coterminal lines.